Industry 4.0. This term became really popular in recent years. Do we really understand what it means for us? Let's have a look. The first revolution transformed the industry by using steam in the 18th century. Mass production was the second, changing our life by the beginning of the 20th century. The industrial usage of computers and automations is the third revolution that we're living in since the 1970s. The fourth revolution, Industry 4.0, has already begun, and it is characterized by connectivity. Connectivity enables people, machines, and products to communicate with each other and cooperatively drive the production. In traditional production, systems. Computers are used as standalone devices to perform specific tasks, like machine automations. In contrast to this, in Industry 4.0, production systems are designed as a network of interacting elements, people, and things. This interaction is provided by connectivity. But what are the things we are talking about? PLCs, computers, mobile devices, machines, and systems are some of the things in our manufacturing environment, like the internet that people use to communicate with each other. Things also speaks with each other, with an Internet of Things platform. This platform integrates the data from many devices and applies analytics to generate the most valuable outputs for specific needs. The advantage of the fast, direct interaction over the new network is the increase of productivity due to faster response times and efficient collaboration between people and things. So, our products, services, Services and processes are about to transform in our manufacturing environment. In PMI, our vision is no touch end-to-end -to -end process to manage this transformation. Our strategy is to leverage on data to drive performance increase. To address it, collaboration between teams from operations technology, equipment and machines, and teams from information technology, software and hardware is established. The process is divided into three steps. Step 1 is to be able to provide data in real time through visibility of what is happening on the machines. Step two is about machine learning algorithms where you use historical data for prediction and anomaly detection. The real-time data from sensors and machines are compared with reference models online by systems. And if any deviation or unexpected trend is observed, notifications are generated. Step three, with the capability to analyze and treat real-time data in Internet of Things platform, machines will be further orchestrated and adjusted automatically. This new computational power started to disrupt our traditional and reactive processes. We are replacing our manual material handling systems with robotics. Image processing, which will automate visual inspections, became a part of our daily business. Predictive maintenance activities are driven by sensors. Central control rooms are already in place to take centralized decisions and orchestrate the process. Self-learning algorithms and systems are supporting technicians for automatic machine adjustments. Augmented reality and digital operator guidance systems substitute traditional documents printed on paper. We keep shaping our future and being one of the leaders in Industry 4.0 by moving forward with many new digital initiatives. So far we have RQMS, Ident Plus, Eyesight, Additive Manufacturing, Digital RTT, and many other projects have arisen. Enthusiasm of our PMI organization in generating more and more manufacturing 4.0 ideas is outstanding. In order to evaluate all these ideas and to align within PMI, we establish Manufacturing 4.0 and Digital Initiatives Governance Board. Our aim is to avoid double development for similar purposes and to ensure right technology selection enabling worldwide application. For brief info on all projects processed by the Manufacturing 4.0 and Digital Initiatives Governance Board so far, stay tuned and have a look on our next video.